So uh, here I am in Florida. We're in central Florida. And I, uh, as I mentioned in the blog, I went by Harmony Gardens and African Violet World, both in uh, the kind of central Florida, Florida area. And these are the collection of plants I got from that trip that I am just going to uh, introduce you to before I strip off all their blossoms, tear off down any damaged leaves, spray them down with some um, safer soap, the neem oil soap, and uh, package them in bins I bought um, so I can get them ready to bring home. So this one is Flashpoint. This one here is Apache Blanket. Um, this is Marching Band. This one here is Harmony's Blue Frills. Um, these are three plants here of a variety called Anna Creek, K-R-E-E-K. -E -E um, here's a classic. Here's a plant of Bob Serbin. This one has got a very large flower. It is called Chris, K-R-I-S. This one is Country Cider. That's also Country Cider. So it looks like it's just developing kind of into its variegated crown. These are three plants here of Ma's Frogland. This is Silver Glade Shadows. That is as well. Um, Apache Bow. And let me just take you around to the other table. Um, as nice as the flowers are, I don't need to be bringing any pests home to my collection. I work so hard to keep it nice and clean. This is Winter Smiles. This is uh, Ma's Debutante. Lion's Bunny Hop. So it looks like not only do... Um, now all these look like they were actually grown by Harmony. They all have the Harmony label. This is Apache Bow. Um, they weren't bought there. Um, and it looks like, and, and I know having been there, that um, Harmony grows a lot of the Robs and Ma's in addition to their own. And it seems some of Lions and a variety of Violets, um, which I guess is pretty much what all of them do. So I'm going to turn this off and I'll show you once I have them stripped um, right before I spray them and pack them away. Okay, so I'm back in the after effect here. I have stripped out, as you can see here, scads of uh, buds and immature leaves or damaged leaves. And I'm sure once I get these plants home, which are now have been sprayed, put back in their sleeves more to contain the leaves, I'm packaging them in these clear large bins so that I can ensure um, they look very clean. The plants look very clean, so this has really been more precautionary than anything else, that if there is anything, they stay that. Um, here's a group of flowers that I um, took off in cleaning down the plants. A nice varied selection. I really enjoy the ruffled ones, but all the variety is nice. Here's the frustration, um, as I was forewarned, and I think you find it anywhere um, in labeling. Anytime the public has access to touch the labels on plants, I think you run the risk of uh, getting mislabeled plants. So both of these, um, these flowers, obviously from different plants, were both labeled Flashpoint which is why the other night I posted a query to the Violet Reflections group asking for the description of Flashpoint. So it is in fact this flower here that is truly Flashpoint. Um, but it's a shame that this beautiful, rich, kind of purple ruffled semi-double will become annoyed. Um, I'll hand it off to somebody who doesn't really care about that. Um, but it's hard to tell. This is why I wish there was a FC2 for uh, the iPhone or an app. Um, many of the plants, more of which are down here, I think all together I have 
a little under 30 from that visit, um, have several um, suckers. So this is a plant of Ma's Melody Girl here. Uh, and I would say once I get this home and tear this apart, and all these plants are in a, a more water holding um, soil medium than I prefer to use at home, I'll change the soil. But I'll end up getting, I'd uh, conservatively estimate, say, five plants from this one pot. Um, so while I won't get a plant as big as what this shows here in this four inch pot, um, still it's true of all these plants that we all know what size plant you get from some of these uh, folks when you order in the mail. They're very small, they're very immature. So essentially I'll get five of those plants for um, a very small fraction of what I would have paid. Um, and it's nice and it's healthy and I don't have very many girl foliage plants. So this I thought was a sweet find. Um, so that's all from my report on these plants from Harmony um, and the Central Florida area. Tomorrow is the Lakeland African Violet Society show in Lakeland, Florida. So I'm sure I'll have more video to share with you then. All right.